welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube. Here to help you break through those fears and live an awesome life. Coffee chat time. All right, I have a something to ponder for you that um, I believe could correct anything in your life and could change the planet. And it is actually easy for every single one of us to do, and you can start doing it today. You could start practicing this like the three second manifesting. We're going to take it out into the material world. What's the three second manifesting? Watch that video where you catch a negative thought, you replace it with a positive one, and you keep doing it all day. What it does really is make you aware of how often you have negative thoughts because we wonder why we're manifesting things that we don't desire. So every time you have the negative thought, you say, what am I manifesting? And ooh, nobody likes that negative thought. So we switch over to the positive one and you go, what am I manifesting? Oh, good. Whew. Yeah, that's what I prefer to manifest. We're going to do something similar because this could absolutely change every situation in your life and everybody else's. When you have any situation arise, whether it's a thought about your past or your future, whether it's a situation where somebody is acting a certain way or there is a challenge, every single thing can be changed, completely transformed, simply by the way you handle it, the reaction to it. Okay, now I'm going to give you an example. I was just with some friends and I was thinking about the situations, the challenges that each of us had a challenge that arose. I mean, I had shared a story and I started thinking right now, sitting here as I was going to shoot this with you, what about those situations made them uncomfortable, made them sort of go into the negative? And I realized it was the reaction by people within the situation. Every single time, it was the reaction. It was how the person within the situation, one or both or several, reacted. Every single situation that we discussed could have been completely different had the players in the situation handled it differently. All right, so I want to share this with you because I realized that was the key to everything. When somebody threatens you or says something or there's a situation that's very negative, appears to be negative, you can ask yourself again, what am I manifesting by how I choose to react to this? All right, what am I manifesting before you do anything? think anything, and your reaction to the situation. Your reaction at every situation is manifesting a disruptive reality or a peaceful one. Ask yourself, what reaction can I have that's on the highest frequency? And it's tough because you have to catch yourself. Situation, reaction, higher frequency, reaction, higher frequency, what's my higher frequency reaction? Your world will absolutely transform and so will everyone's. Everyone will be affected because every time somebody says something that they didn't realize was gonna hurt your feelings or they did something or they fired off a statement, they're reacting in a lower frequency. If you react in the higher frequency, you cancel it out and no matter how they continue on, you're canceling it out and you're raising your reality frequency. Your world will start to function at a higher reality. And you keep doing it. So, am I reacting in the highest frequency? Even if that other person is not, that's your test. So you can sit and blame, but they said, or they say, you're not getting the game. You're not getting it. That is the, that's the game. How are you gonna play this game? The game is to raise your frequency. Raise your frequency. <clears throat> I have a situation, ooh, whether you think you're right or wrong, half the time we think we're right and it's, it's a neutral situation. Somebody else is not feeling good, they fire off or they're crabby or tired and they say something and 
and your reaction could fuel that and go to the negative or go to the higher. We must react in compassion, love if that's possible, and if not, go into neutral. At, at least in neutral, you have not gone to a negative frequency. And then your world will be neutralized. It will not be a negative. Well, you're not going to go into that negative space. This is so powerful. So powerful because it makes you super aware of that interaction with the material world. This is the toughest thing about being human, interacting with the material world. Woo-wee! Because it's, it's happening. It's coming. And then every time you switch over, you are changing the reality within your human experience. Not mine. You affect the collective consciousness in a big, big way. But your reality will switch because those were your personal experiences. And so thus, you just switched lanes into a higher frequency and now you're going to get different experiences now. When you switch to the lower frequency, you're feeling bad that energy's with you. You're, you know, you probably get more challenges. Try it. Every day, switch into the higher frequency. A reaction of higher frequency. A reaction of higher frequency or neutral. And you do those two things all day. Higher thought, higher reaction. You will go into an awakened state. And you keep doing it and doing it and doing it. And pretty soon, the negative thoughts and temptation to react in a lower frequency doesn't even happen anymore. You feel so peaceful because you're on that higher frequency. It doesn't even, nothing bothers you anymore. This is how we go into awakening. The material world will change. Your inner peace will change. You're going to project out to that material world. It's all going to go higher frequency, feeling good. All the other people within those frequencies are going to be kinder, more neutral, or higher frequency people. It is an amazing way to live. And that means letting your ego go, not having to be right. And knowing that what's really most important is that this person knows you care about them. Because we're human beings and sometimes we make mistakes and sometimes we're not making mistakes at all, but that person is not in a good place to accept whatever you said or whatever they interpreted it in, ne in a negative way. So don't judge that. It doesn't matter how they interpret it or what they're thinking. It's the situation is there for you to react in a higher frequency. Give it a try. I know you guys are doing amazing things. We're going in fifth dimension now. It's, uh, it's uh, unbelievable. And these things are sloughing off. Opportunities, opportunities. All right, so you're whole and perfect, strong and powerful, loving, harmonious, and happy. Blessings, my friend. Let's go there. It's so amazing. Let's go there. Namaste.